Hey everybody, it's uh, HK, she, her. Thought we'd do a nice little wallow stuff video and check out our shelves over here. So we're just gonna kinda look at everything. As you can see the way this light is in this room, I'm gonna kinda be covering everything with shadow, but I'll try and make sure that doesn't happen as much as possible. Let's just go top to bottom. We got our uh, final Pam poster. This is actually something we got for Jay, but it's still in our room. Gotta love Final Pan. Let's see here. Over here we have our uh, Lego Friends. Is what they call it, I think. Let's flip this one around so we can get a look inside. It's kind of like meant for like little girls, but we saw we saw these and they're pretty cheap. And we were like, oh man, we can get our very own like dog and cat shelter that is the cutest thing and there's this little little thing it comes with you can uh me uh that cat's on here you can put uh the pet in here and then ride around with it Boop. <laughs> and emergency yeah this is i think this is super cute let me try and put this back in Okay, that's not gonna work. I'll just leave it like this and fix it later. <laughs> They're super cute. They're pretty cheap. We we kind of, you know, it's kind of like we never had a dollhouse stuff as a kid, so we're kind of fitting that in with these. And we've got this nice little nature scene over here. It's cute. Um, got this Lego thing. This is like a three-in-one Jay got us, and we made him that way. Got this little uh, Space Invaders cabinet. That's actually a uh, Nano blocks. We've decided we do not like nano blocks, but it's pretty neat because you can see games going on in there. Nano blocks are just a bit too small for us, <laughs> our big hands. Uh, got some like blind box stuff. We've got the thing. I don't remember this guy's name. He's from Bleach and Lapis. Here. Lapis, why don't you uh, move out of the way for a second? So we can look at the Disneyland Mini Haunted Mansion. This was a fun little build. I hope they make a big Haunted Mansion, but look, you can see the, uh, it's like where you go up above and that's like the ballroom scene. That's very fun. Disneyland is not our favorite Haunted Mansion because we're, well, Disney World's our main park, but it's pretty neat to have. Here's Zero Two. She's just hanging out. Here we have the, uh, Lego Optimus Prime, standing like a foot tall. Still nervous with him. What's he got behind him? Oh, he's got his uh, weapons. He comes with this axe you can put in his hand. But we've got him with his gun. He can transform. We have not worked up the nerve to actually attempt that. We're still too scared of him uh, falling apart. <laughs> Let's get back to normal. Right below him, we have our other Transformer shelf. So that's uh, Chrome Dome and Rewind, which if you've read More Than Meets the Eye, you might know they're, they're gay. They're hanging out together because they're gay. Uh, that wind blade back there is actually a model, as are these two, and as is this Devastator. Uh, Devastator, I'll actually pick up Devastator. Wind blade we get nervous about. She's pretty fragile, but Devastator really like this one. We like how it incorporates all the uh, construction vehicles. Got those treads on it. It really looks like uh, five construction vehicles came together, which is pretty neat. So yeah, we've got mini RC and that one, regular RC. I think that's Earth? No. Whatever the show was before the current one is what line she's from. Over here, we've got our Danganronpa collection. Just got Sumiki in like a couple days ago. And we've got Kyoko and Junko and the Junko Nendoroid. They actually screwed up the crown. There's like a uh, plastic tab you're not supposed to pull out, but we saw a plastic tab. So the first thing we did was pull it out. So that crown isn't staying on like it should, but she's still wearing it. She's still the queen. Uh, over here, we got uh, Mega Man X shooting at Tracer. It took me a second to remember her name. We also got Hamster. I don't remember his name. We didn't play Overwatch that much. We got these just because they were cheap and we were playing it at the time. And now we're like, we don't even care about Overwatch. We got this Cookie Run set. 
This is pretty neato. You got zombie cookie down there. It looks like, it actually looks like Cookie Run. Oven Break specifically. We know a lot of people play Kingdom, but Oven Break's our favorite. If I get back here, uh, I can actually, uh, somewhere back here. <laughs> Hold on. I can get it. I can get it on video. There we go. The uh, fireplace lights up, which is pretty neat. Let me turn that back off. Okay. This is our first time doing this kind of video with phones, so we're being a bit awkward. Sorry about that. Uh, Castle in the Sky. This is a model our dad painted and gave to us, which we really appreciate. It's very, very nicely painted. Get like a uh, side view of that. Yeah, it's pretty nice. I like it a lot. I'm gonna sit down as we get down to this shelf. Uh, we got some Funko Pops and stuff here. Got a Devo Whippet guy, uh, Spider Man. We won this one. I move them out of the way. We got Rocketeer back there. Great movie, great comics, Rocketeer. Over here's our little Alice collection. So these we thought were like a blind box, but then we ordered them and they aren't actually blind and we ended up with some extras. So we have these two. Uh, we don't really care about Peter Pan at all, but you know, it's a nice little uh, Disney Parks crowd. We've got Catwoman, Batman Return style. Also won that one in a contest. Let's give her a 360. Really like her. Batman Returns is one of our favorite Batman movies, so really glad we got that. We got this uh, Trigonized Raven or something. I don't know, she looks cool as hell though, right? If you're gonna get a Raven statue, she'll look that cool. And then we've got the Lego Green Hill set here. And so they announced more Sonic sets, but so these actually have these things at the end. You can super see it on that side. These pegs, like, they're made to connect to like another Sonic set. So we thought they were gonna do more like those. And they've announced more and now they're not in that same style. <laughs> but yeah, it's a it's a cool set. We we are really glad we got this. You can uh you can turn the checkpoint around. Oop. Maybe not. You can there's uh different faces for these. And the spring kind of works, but I don't remember how to do that, so I'm not going to mess with it right now. And on our last shelf, uh, Jay got this at the convenience store? Oh, it's a, it's a piggy bank. I thought it was just a shadow box. But yeah, it's like a Wonder Woman uh, shadow box with some uh, covers in the back. I guess it's also a piggy bank, apparently. I had no idea until right this moment. <laughs> And these two, I just tried to get them out of the clamshell, but I could not. Uh, we got Coraline here. You know, we love us some Coraline. I ignore that price sticker. I don't remember how much she was. I don't think it was that much. Yeah, this, uh, apparently her eyes move if you get her out. That'd be pretty cool. Love to actually get her out of the clamshell someday. And we got this, uh, ooh, that was a terrible sound. <laughs> Got this Muppets Uncle Deadly figure. It's like a special variation, so he's not his normal color, but he comes with a ghost and a skull, and he's Uncle Deadly, and so we we love it, of course. One of our favorites. And yeah, that's just our that's just our shelf of stuff. I hope you enjoyed looking at it, and if you did, tell us what you like best or just talk about fandom stuff or cool things you have. I don't know. I don't care. I don't know what this type of video is supposed to be like, so just have a blast. But yeah, that'll be it. Uh, bye everybody.